create a circle on your paper. Um, and then we are going to practice one of these. You can practice more than one at home. This says student government survey students about how much time they spend at school, at home, and outside of school. At school, excuse me, my fault. How much time they spend at school, at home, and actually just being outside. And we want to display these results on a circle graph. And so let's look at part A. We have three options right now to practice. So first, make yourself a circle. And let's do the first one. I need to come up with the percentages that are going to correspond with this first option. So 40 and 10 is, is 50, and 50 and 12 is 62. So I'm going to put a 62 underneath each one of these. And now I'm going to figure out the percentage. So 40 divided by 62 is approximately 65%. And 12 divided by 62 is approximately 19%. 10 divided by 62 is approximately 16%. Okay, now I need to draw a circle that is going to model this information. So I personally do it like this. I'm going to split this up into four sectors. Each sector is 25%. So here's 25 and here's 25, I need to get to 65. I'm going to take this third one and break it evenly into five equal sections. Each one is going to be worth 5%. So here's 5, 10, 15, 20, and 25. Okay, I need to get up to 65. So here's 25, there's 50, okay, 55, 60, 65. There is this region, and you need to label it, this represents school. 65%. Okay, I'm going to choose to do the 19% next because I'm going to go over here and I'm going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to split it up so there's 5, 10, 15, 20, and 25. Now I need to come up with 19, which is really close to 20. 5, 10, 15, 20. So it's just a little bit less than this mark, which means I'm going to go just a little bit before that and I'm going to do a different type of mark here. Okay, this region, this 19%, represents home, and the remaining portion is going to represent outside, and that is 16%. You're welcome to practice option B and option C on your own.